It's been such a long, long time. But I'm back, y'all. It's a tip from the Brick Show. And we back with a whole new season. A whole season, period. You know what I mean? I'm going to make this season be about black-owned businesses. And today's word of the day, I think I'm going to have a word of the day today, is going to be cooperation. Or maybe it should be impulse. And we're going to put them together, cooperation and impulse, because I'm impulsively doing this show because I'm trying to get the ball rolling on it. And I've been struggling with cooperation, making it happen, maybe because I'm doing it on impulse. But we here, Tips from the Brick Show, back for another season. Check us out. So our first location, black owned business, is Hippie Empire right here at 82 Clinton Ave. Beauty Salon. Here's that. Let's bomb. Wanna introduce yourself? Okay, hold on. Loctician. Right here. Christian. Loctician. Wash my hair right now. I'm crying in here. And Sendaya, you wanna introduce yourself? Okay, and this is Hippie Empire. Okay, could you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Chris. Um, I'm one of the owners of Hippie Empire. That's the other owner over there. You won't let me move your hand. Oh, you excuse me. To? You got to take it easy, man. Take it easy. <laughs> I want to tell you your whole body. But yeah, that's the other owner over there. Her name is Autumn. Um, okay. Hippie Empire has been open for three years now. We've been at this location since August 2020. And um, yeah, we oh. twisted 60s, style started 10. You should come check us out. You can you can you can follow us at H E Salon One on Instagram and hit the Empire is dot com. Okay, so um do y'all only do locks and styles? No, we specialize in the upkeep and maintenance of natural hair. So if you like twist outs, box braids, sew ins, quick weaves, all of that type of stuff, um, we do that. All right, is, is there anything here that y'all don't do? Or, no. okay. No, we do everything. Except right. for like, yeah, we're, all salon stuff, except for like, uh, Pedicures and manicures, and right now we're we don't have a barber. Okay. And if you'd like to barber, <laughs> come check us out. Okay, and um, and what what's y'all working hours, operating hours? From ten, and our last client is at four thirty. Every day. Every day, last appointment set at four thirty. And y'all open every day too. Yes, except for Sunday. Sundays we're closed. Okay. And I guess that'll be all. Thank you. Thank you. you. Okay, so this is Hippie Empire, and this is our product line. We have everything from rosewater infused uh, essential oil hair moisturizer to black rice water moisturizer and hair oils, growth oils. We also have a beard oil. And if you're looking for accessories for yourself or somebody else, we have rings, we have lock cuffs. And we have arm cuffs, bracelets, precious stone uh, pieces, earrings, more pendants and neck pieces. Prices range from everything from 25 to and up. These are our t-shirts. We have long sleeve and short sleeve. They start at $20 as well. 
And we have company shirts, more t-shirts, graphic tees, face masks. We also have hoodies, but none are inside of this t-shirt collection here. Back, man, it's a tip from the Brit Show. Another word of the day is procrastination, man, because I've been taking long as hell to finish this episode. We're about to get it done, man. We're about to turn up, finish the job. So, y'all can check out this hoop of spit. But first, watch me not just jump. <laughs> Tips from the Brit Show presents Who Could Spit right here with Ace to Face. I right, spit that shit. Look, ain't the face, fuck that, Mr. Talk to him. Bring the lean, bring the motherfucker, walk to him. I'm the battery, I'm about to bring the spark to him. These niggas are scared, we about to bring the heart to him. Break down, dojo shit. Bring the art to him. Nice stretch, stretched on floor. Bring the cart to him. Lee Boy, got that glow. It's the start to him. Big pit mixed with pit. Nah, I'm good, man. I'm good. Never know where I might pop up. Never know where I might pop up, so have them bars ready. Okay. Oh. Never know where I might pop up, so have them bars ready. Long day, CEO of Fried Chicken. Check us out, Fried Chicken LLC, IG. Pajamas, shorts, workout, 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 kids, whatever. Check us out, though. Fried chicken.
Tits from the Brick Show presents Who Could Blow, right here with Ambitious I Met. What up, dog? It's something real life, you know. Or just for a shorty, you dig? So, you know, this is how we gonna do it. How did I find someone like you? You made me believe it's possible to overcome these obstacles in life. How did I find someone like you? And I swear. Check me out on IG, ambitious double underscore I made. That's A M B I T I U S double underscore A H M E D. Holla, bricks. This is good. What's up, guys? My name is Sienna Robinson, and I just recently self published and authored a book called Good Hair Day. I believe it to be a self empowerment, self confidence building book that shows the love and appreciation for our very, very different and unique black hair care experience. So if you want to send this to any little girls that you know, or if you're interested in finding out more about the main character's name is Cece and what she goes through in her everyday hair experience, please, please, please make sure that you hit up goodhairdaybook.com. I believe this to be a book that every little black girl should have. Um, it's important for the culture. Thank you so much. This show is about community, loving, and supporting each other. So let's do that. There's a tip from the break show. Outside of How Delish, West Orange, New Jersey. Kings we had somewhere, sign somewhere. <laughs> Kings we had. The owner of How Delish. You want to introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Chef Q. Um, I'm the owner of How Delish here in West Orange, New Jersey. The address is 55 Kingsley Street. Um, we offer vegan desserts and jelly sandwiches and a bunch of other things. Okay, so which, how would you classify your business? Is it like vegan or more so vegetarian? Because it's say plant based. So. Well, we're 100% vegan. Um, okay. Vegetarian is still like. Um, Okay, so tell me about how long you've been here and what made you start, how delish, and all of that type of stuff. Okay, so we've been at this location um, since May 1st, 2020. So we opened a snack during the pandemic. Um, that was challenging, but we've been established since 2017. We got our start uh, supplying restaurants with desserts, and then it quickly turned into the main festival um, in New York. We started in Brooklyn, and then we expanded to Jersey, Maryland. Okay. Tell me, like, what would be like three of your top selling items here? All right. So three of the top selling items for sandwiches. I don't know what you have, but for sandwiches, it's the pastrami, um, the chickpea tuna, and the BLC. Those are our top sellers. Now, those are popular amongst people that are vegan and people that aren't. Uh, we have a lot of customers that come here to eat. They are not vegan. Um, and then for desserts, I would say our tiramisu. And it's like an Italian dessert. I don't know if you've heard of it before. It has a little rum and coffee in it. And then our banana pudding cheesecake and our carrot cake. Those are our three top sellers for desserts. Okay. Um, and... Could you tell me a little bit about like your availability and operating hours and stuff? Okay, so we're open Thursday through Sunday. Um, we're closed Monday through Wednesday, but we are open for cake pickups. So if you place an order for a cake, you can get an appointment to pick up Monday through Wednesday. Otherwise, we're open Thursday from 12 to 6, Friday from 12 to 10, Thursday night, Saturday and Sunday from 
breakfast from 9 to 12, and then for lunch from 9, to, I'm sorry, from 12 to 8 on Saturday, and from 12 to 6 on Sunday. So you can't order anything at all on Monday through Wednesday? No. no okay. We're actually closed. Um, we do have online ordering, the scheduled orders, so if you were, you found yourself wanting something, you want to make sure you got it since you opened, you can actually go online and place an order um, and schedule it for the days we're opening. All right, and, what, and what's the website? Our website is howdelishhd.com, and there's a spot for order takeout on our home page, and then you also can go and get a delivery to Uber Eats and Grub Club if you're local, and there's a, when you drop down, you can select orders for um, cake pickup, so you can see our cakes that we offer, um, and catering also is there. Okay, and... Would you like to add any following words that maybe the people may know about you or anything to, to draw in extra customers to your business? Sure. Um, I mean, I'm from here. I, you know, I grew up in East Orange. Um, I now live in West Orange. But, you know, as I said, we traveled so far and we met so many people. We thought it was important to include them in our business. So that's what our community wall is about behind us. So if you were to stop by and visit, you can... Um, Get your name up here on this wall amongst, I think it's about maybe about 2,500 names up here. Um, you can add your name to the wall and you know, be a part of our community. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks for highlighting our business. We really appreciate anything, you know, any word that gets out. And uh, come visit us. Be good or not. We have some good stuff here. All right. Thank you. Y'all, oh, thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. Episode done. Don't forget to like, subscribe, show your support. Thank you again for watching. Bye, y'all.